What is going on everybody? Today I wanted to talk about my EDC, also known as Everyday Carry. So what is EDC? EDC is short for Everyday Carry and whether you realize it or not, it's the things that you bring with you in your pockets or on your person on a daily basis. And what's cool about it is that it's unique to everybody, so it fits everybody's needs accordingly. So what I want to show today is what I carry with me almost always on a daily basis. Obviously there can be some exceptions every now and then if the situation asks for it, but this is my core everyday carry, so this is something I almost always have with me. Anyways, if you're new to my channel, thank you for stopping by. Here on the channel, I mostly talk about minimalism, self-improvement, habit building, and things of nature. So if that sounds very interesting to you, you should definitely consider subscribing and hitting the like button below. And let's jump right into the video. So the first thing I have is something that pretty much everybody else also does, a phone. I personally use a OnePlus Nord because it's a great value for money purchased and it serves pretty much most of the functions that I need readily available on me, obviously texting and calling, but also serves as a GPS. I use Spotify for music, online banking, listening to podcasts and audiobooks, alarm in the morning and a few photo editing apps. I prefer a clear see-through cover, obviously for the protective ability, also because it looks lighter than a darker or more solid cover and I really like this simple aesthetic that I got from it. The next thing I have is my wallet and it's a very dad-like wallet and it's something I swore when I was younger I would never get. It obviously could be a lot more minimalistic but as we have kids we have their public healthcare IDs, our own IDs, IDs for work, driving licenses, institutional health cards and credit cards. On top of that I always feel good like having a small amount of cash on me just in case so this wallet serves its purpose even though it's a bit bigger than just a small pop-up wallet. Next thing is my keys. And I don't think I could ever get this uh, being fueled because I have my car key and then I have my house key. And that's just it, those two keys. And this small appendant. This is something of a wallet. If you go to do, use a shopping cart in the supermarkets here, you have to either use a coin or something like this because this is a perfect size for that. We have three doors in our house and all of them have rekeyed to the same key, so we just need this one instead of having multiple. Other useful keys that we have are just a small cabinet for bicycles and mailbox and spare keys, so we don't have any need to carry those around at all times. And then I, of course I have my watch, and this is something I'm very happy about. It's a Psycho, so it's really inexpensive. It's waterproof and it's perfect for everyday wear and I can easily scratch it and don't mind at all if anything happens to it. And the last thing is my in-ear headphones. I use a brand called Jabra. I don't own any Apple products beside an iPad and this is such a quality product. I use them for my podcast listing, audiobooks and music obviously. Pretty much any time I can, I can, whether it's when I'm folding laundry, cooking or traveling or just needing to hear something. So that is my core EDC and the stuff that I bring with me on a very consistent basis. I'd say I almost never leave the house without all these items. And in the future, I'll make a video where I show my professional EDC for my job and traveling with the job. Anyway, thank you for watching. And if you like this video, leave a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time.